Hey guys, um, I want to do this because someone asked me to show my blush collection. Um, and it's big. So I'm going to start off with my MAC palettes. I still have other MAC blushes, but these are the ones in palettes. Um, these are my um, MAC blushes. I have Peaches, Dark Plum, um, Stubborn. That's a prolonged wear blush and modern mandarin. And these two right here are blunt and sh shady or shadowy. This is like contour. And I used to love this. I haven't used it in a minute. But I used to love this to contour my nose with. And, well, no, this one right here. Contour my nose with because this is blunt. I, this is saucer rose. This is devil. And this one right here is Raisin. So, yeah. That's what's in that palette. Now, I have, like, two stacks of um, eyeshadows like this. This one's a little bit shorter. So, I'm going to this one first. So, I have two of the MAC blushes. I have uh, Make You Mine. This is a prolonged wear blush. This is, like, I haven't... This is very gorgeous, though. I love this blush. Um, this one is Life's a Picnic. I haven't had this, this that long. You see how bright that is. Summer's Calling. Um, another one. This one is Sketch. Like, you. Oh my goodness, so pretty. Um, I was thinking of contouring with this one. Because it is really dark, but I can still sheer it out. Okay, my battery died on me. So I sold you. Sketch. Then I have um, uh, Film Noir. It's a very dark um, um, blush. And this is um, Sketch. You can see them side by side. So it's just a little bit more darker, a little bit more purpler. Purpler. More purple, dark purple. So I love these two. I think Sketch you can. Excuse me. If you um, are dark, darker, you can really contour with that. Even film noir. Um, I have a mineralized blush. This is in Love Joy. Y'all, so pretty. Um, another one is Swiss Chocolate. I love this. Very subtle um, blush. And yes, it does show up. It shows up on me and it's just, it's like a faint kiss of, um, pink. It's really pretty. Um, another mineralized blush. This is in Gleeful. This is so pretty. I love this blush. Um, then I have, okay, I already said those too. Okay, now I have my Simpsons blush. This is in Sideshow You. Very pretty pink. It's a little ashy on me. I gotta mix it with something else. Um, then I have my Wonder Woman blushes. Um, this one is uh, Amazoning Amazing Princess. Maze on presents. Um, I always had a kind of issue with this because this was pressed really hard and it was you really gotta dig to get a payoff if you want one. And of course you want one. Um I didn't get these in store, I got them online. So this one is Mighty Aphrodite. I really had to scrape this blush just to get like a payoff because it get that hard pan to it. Um, I haven't really used this brush as much as I should, but yeah, I'm really focused on Mighty Aphrodite. Mighty Aphrodite. So then I got this right here, um, freshen, freshen up. This is a highlight powder. No, this is a blush, a blush. Um, and even then, I really gotta like really get in there because again pressed really really hard um another two i got the plenser what's her name 
um, Palencia Schooler blushes. The ombre blushes. I This one is Ocean City. And the other one is Sunset Beach. Like a purple. Um, again, these are, are hard pressed too. You really got to dig into it to get something like you gotta dig and it's like a hot pink blush it's very sexy but yeah love those oh my hand okay now are the mac T Toledo blushes i missed the first umbra blushes that i went in trying to get these um this one is kindergarten red pretty still pressed really hard you really got to dig in there to get it out then I have bright peach and the last one is azalea uh, blossom and I really scraped this this is like really hard pan like really bad I have to like scrape it just to get like somewhat some type of payoff from it so yeah I still have not turn it because I really like the packaging and I did like the outcome even though I had to scrape it to get get it all get payoff and then another blush I got is light over dark it's a mineralized um, blush this is so beautiful um other blushes I have in here are makeup geek I have Pegacorn uh Cheerio This is the problem the pan gets stuck in the cap this is Cheerio and I kind of think they're drying out. Oh, no, not really. Oh, I love the feeling of these. Um, this is Pegacorn. I just got caught up in my own moment. This is Pegacorn. Um, this one is Tonic. Tonic is like an orange color. Oh, it's so pretty, though. Oh. Orange on dark skin is just so gorgeous. Um, Swift. Like a darker. It's like um, Pinky Brown. Very pretty. If you want a subtle blush. And that's one little stack. And this is my other one. Um, I'm going to show you the new ones that I just bought. This is from Estee Lauder. This is in Soulful Spice. And I also got, what's the other one, uh, Wild Sunset. So pretty. I have on Soulful Spice now. Very pretty. Um, I have one Illamasqua blush. And I bought this a long time ago when MAC still had, not MAC, Sephora still had Illamasqua in their, um, in their store. This is an Excite you really can't see how bright and how gorgeous this really is. This is so pretty. Um, I have a cream blush. I have Becca's. Becca, um, what is the name of you? Gava? Gava? Gava. It's right here. And a Makeup Forever High Definition Blush. And what were you called? I haven't used this in so long. Okay, this didn't dry it out. Because it's not even trying to come out. Okay. Uh, it was number two. I gotta throw that away. So, <laughs> that's sad. Um, I have a uh, uh, Urban Decay blush. And this is called Bittersweet. 
just so pretty so pretty so purple love it and i have a blush by becca this is in songbird now i like this but it's a little too light i feel like i have to use another blush kind of like a blush topper to put on top of it because it is kind of shimmery but it's still really pretty let me show you again that's songbird and i have from becca the um blush copper and i like this i tried it with just this but this truly is like something you put on top of your blush like a little you know a little something a little shimmer shimmer going down in the club you know just a little little nice little top top off really pretty though then i have my two hourglass um blushes one is in radiant magenta let me show it to you a little bit more radiant magenta other is uh, luminous flush those two are very pretty um, I have one blush from Topshop I got from Nordstrom's and this is in let her go very pretty um, pink I have two blushes from Clinique I have Colourpop 07 very gorgeous and I have berry pop um this is number three berry pop cola pop I'm, I'm gonna get into my NARS blushes but don't kill me I barely understand what NARS be going through with that name of their blushes this is a cream blush this is from Stila this is in Gildelia Gildelia Okay, sorry, I had to stop for a minute. So, the next four are my Makeup Forever Cream blushes. I have 410. This is 410. This is in 210. This is very lilac pink. I shouldn't have got this one. This is really, really, really um, pink. A uh, lilac y type of pink. But I kept it because I feel like I can do something with it. Um, then I got 415. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is like a like a brown um pink. Very pretty. Um, the other one is 515 very orange very pretty love orange then i have a dior um blush this is in rosy glow and it smells like artificial like roses or something yeah i don't like the smell of it but it's really pretty it's not as light as what is coming off right now um but it's really, really pretty. Uh, I think they all are pretty. I have a Estee Lauder blush. Oh, I didn't know I had it. Okay. <laughs> Say it. It's an Estee Lauder brush. I got this at a CCO. This is in um, Naughty Satin. It's very pretty um, pink. Um, very warm pink. And I have another Dior blush. And this is 676 Coral Cruise. Very pretty. I love this. So nice in the summer. Then I have this from NARS. This is a, this is Sin. Over here is Sin. And this is Casino uh, Bronzer. It's okay. It doesn't show up. The bronzer doesn't show up on me. As much as I wanted to, but um, I really wanted this right here. At the time, I wanted this too, so I ended up just getting this um, palette. But I do like Sin. It just has a little bit 
shimmer to it but it's okay um I have a NARS um, blush I just got. This is in Frenzy. So pretty. I only use it once though. We will, shoot. we will use it again. So getting to the broke of my blushes are NARS. Um, these are all NARS blushes. Um, I have Almeria. Very pretty. also have Seduction. This is 413 Block. Very cute. Nice pink color. Um, another one is Torrid. It's like a nice pink um, a little bit of brown to it it was some shimmer but the shimmer doesn't really show up on it and that's torrent next one is um Gaguli. Gagum. this is new um this is really pretty too it's like it has shimmer in it but it's like a darker pink with a little bit of purple to it then I have Taj Mahal like yes orange come through yes so pretty um i have dolce vita this is like a darker pink so pretty i love nars blushes as you can see um then i have exhibit a very dark red color their blushes never come off like you think it would. Like this color is gorgeous, but it doesn't come off like super like boom boom. So pretty. Then I have um taco. What is it called? Taco tacos? Not taco. Taco. Oh no, not tacos. Like that. This is so pretty. This is a little bit darker, a little bit more richer pink. Still got a little shimmer in it, but it's so pretty. And it doesn't really come through like that. Like sh The shimmer doesn't come through. Um, then my last one is Libertine. Libertine is it's a pink. It's a little bit darker and a little bit more richer. So, yeah. I'm just justifying all these pinks. That's what I'm doing. So, that's all my blushes. Um... Um, thank you for uh, leaving that in the comment. If anyone wants me to show anything else, um, just leave a comment below. I'd be happy to. Um, so, yeah. So, <laughs> bye. Till next time. Thank you for watching.